So you're looking for some canine enrichment ideas for your dog. Well, stick with me because in this video, we're gonna be talking about the treat ball. Hey, I'm Jessica, the furry family coach. And in this video, we're gonna be talking about the treat ball. Now, this is a pretty typical treat ball that you can find at most pet stores or online retailers and I'm going to show you one idea of how to use this treat ball. Now of course you can find treats that just barely fit through the holes and uh, give that to your dog. Put the treats inside of the ball and give it to your dog and have them try to get the treats out. One other suggestion I have, I had all of these fleece strips left over from the snuffle mat that I made or even if you don't have any left over, you can buy some clearance fleece. Um, you can get it really inexpensively. And we're gonna take some just little training size chews. I'm gonna show you what we're gonna do. We're gonna take one strip at a time. We're gonna take these tiny little treats, or if you feed your dog kibble, you can use the kibble too. And we're just gonna roll the treat up inside of the fleece strip and insert it into our treat ball just like that. And you can use as many fleece strips as it takes to fill up your treat ball because they do make different sized treat balls. This one is probably a medium sized treat ball, but I like to do this with my treat ball. Now, because obviously we don't want our dog ingesting the fleece, I do not recommend you leaving your dog alone with this particular toy. Um, but it is a really great brain exercise for your dog trying to figure out how to get the fleece strips out. Now, if you're just starting out with this particular type of toy and you want to go ahead and use the fleece strips because this is a little bit more advanced than just putting treats inside of the ball, what I recommend you doing is taking some of the treats and putting them inside of the treat ball, they're gonna very easily fall out. It will go ahead and give your dog some instant gratification to play with the treat ball and incentive to continue pulling these pieces of fleece out to get the rest of the treat. So there you have it, one suggestion and how to go ahead and use simple items you find around your home to make a little bit harder for your dog to give them additional brain exercises. And Kim is already trying to get at the treats inside of the treat ball. So with that, I'm going to say goodbye in this video. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to comment if you have any questions. If you've tried this and it has worked out well for your dogs, please leave a message below. Subscribe to my YouTube channel so you can get notified every time I post a new video. Until the next video, I'll see you next time at My Furry Family.